Yo guys, welcome to my Uberlab video efficient chest for October the 15th. It's another pretty fast lab today. So here we go. So the first area is going to have a silver key. We're going to get all three silver keys this run. So I'm going to try up into the right first because you go into this indoor thing. And then we're going to go to the right. And there's the key. It either be to the right or a little bit to the left. Here we go. Grab this, grab this. So how are you enjoying your Blade Flurry build? Blade Fury, sorry. So it either be there or to the left over here for the key. So once you get your key, you want to run up out of here and up into the right and then you want to head into the tunnel here and then uh, go into the next area the next area is going to have a puzzle so we're going to head to the left first and there's the puzzle so mine has them all off so you just hit all the middle ones And then hit all the corner ones. You liked it better than Dark Pack? Yeah, um... Blade, or Blade Flurry's, uh... Is fun. I have never really made a build around it yet, though. But from what I tried of it, it was fun. For sure. That Dark Pack's a little different. I've never tried it yet. Well, I tried it with Mines, but I died at, like, level 30. So after, the, after we get the puzzle, we just want to go up and to the left and through a trap sequence. So here we go. Uh, grab the switch, just run through. So for this one, you need to grab these three switches to open the doors. Pretty easy. Gotta love it when Flame Dash teleports you backwards. And then... Uh, Head to the exit. Is the uh, Blade Flurry build the, your second build, or...? It seems like you're enjoying it a lot better. So for the third room, there's gonna be a Silver Key and a Dark Shrine. So here's the Silver Key. Grab the chest. A e. There must be a Grab the lever. Then run through the fire pits of death. Can I not have but a moment's respite? And I can't wait for like the one week races that they got coming up gonna be fun so here's uh, the other thing that we need in here the uh, dark shrine so you just the switches over there in the corner and then we get that so now we want to go up into the left to get to Azaro. I think is right here oh, let me through the door no nope. it'll be over here so if you're there, you just go to the left. The exits are right beside each other. Head in here. Made Dark Black Cyclone. Okay, I like Cyclone a lot. Cyclone's fun. So the first phase is going to be Lieutenants. Pretty easy as Aro today. I got a build plan for the one week when it comes out. I'm gonna keep it like top secret in a reef case handcuffed to my wrist. I'm sure it's someone's already done it, but I just have an idea. 
And I know it will work, because... Because it will work. <laughs> Bob Ross said so. Alright, so... Uh, oh, I forgot to mention, uh, there is a Dark Shrine and a Gauntlet in here. So this looks like it's going to be the, the Gauntlet. We just want to get all these Weavers. So we got that Weaver. I hate this trap sequence. It's just long. Not hard, but it's long. So you got to go get that one. And then run all the way around here. All the way around here. Get the Weaver. Then you got to run all the way up to the top here. I'll still take it over standing in that thing now. There's none of those in this, uh, in this lab. Uh, no, they go to standard league and then when the next week comes out, you're all fresh again. So you start off with a clean slate. So now we want to head up here. And uh, the door should be up and to the left, but we want to go a little bit south of it. Because I believe that's where the Dark Shrine is. I just want to keep going right, keep going right. And then turn right here. And there's the uh, Dark Shrine. So the two different things that you need will probably be in those two spots. They were there both times when I did it. So the upper left and then kind of like the bottom right. But get the upper left one first, because the door that you need is in the upper right. But yeah, your items will go to standard league. And then you can use them there, but when the next league comes out, then uh, it's like a clean, fresh slate. And things get interesting for a little while. So this area is going to have a silver key. And that's it, so we want to get the silver key and then head up and to the left. So we're going to check the, the left side here first to see if the silver key is here. It doesn't look like it because it's the shortcut, which doesn't lead to anywhere special. So here's the silver key. Run up and around. Where there's a silver. And then head up around here. And we want to head to the left, so we're going to have to go through a trap sequence to get to the left. So if the key's on the right, then you want to take like an immediate left. And it will be, uh, it'll, it should take you all the way to the trap sequence thing. Are you interested in uh, playing in the next league as well, uh, Turtle? Uh, currency goes to uh, standard as well. All your stuff goes to standard, and then it's like you start off with nothing. In uh, bit, where am I? Oh, okay. This room is uh, hold on. Yeah, so this room has a silver door, which we're gonna get, and Argus. So here's Argus. I'm not in a good spot right now. Oh. Nope. So there's the treasure key. Dang, yeah, it's nice though, like when you've been playing in a in a league for so long and it's like you can start off fresh. I like it personally, but I can see why it's not for everybody. So we're gonna head up past the trap sequence and it will either be down and to the right here, which I don't think it is this time, or to the left of the exit. But here's the exit, so it should be Aspirin's Trial. We'll head over here, and here's the door. So this uh, silver room, just have to hit all the time cranks and the, and the time before the first one deactivates. So there we go. Boom. Using Scour. That's pretty good. Not bad. And then we head up into the right. Aspirin's trial. When the time comes to strike, an emperor strikes without So the next uh, part of Azaro is going to be essences. So uh, golems. It should be pretty easy for you to get an extra key. You just need to leave them all alive. Prove yourself 
Ascendant. And then just give it a second here. Watch my golem roll around. I just run around in circles until he goes away. <laughs> That's just how I roll. And then the lieutenants will still attack you at the end, but... Oh, I don't know how Xbox is. Um, I'm assuming it's going to be the same. How do you like the game on Xbox, by the way? I'm kind of curious to hear feedback on that. So this room's going to have a... Uh, a silver door and... And then we want to go up into the right. So I think the silver door, silver door will either be to the left, or if you run through here, it'll be to the right. Usually, there it is. So you just gotta look for these saw blades. There's a silver door. Got the vault. And then, uh, we want to head up here and we want to go up into the left, uh, up into the right. Up into the left technically shorter, but there's no, uh, treasure loot stuff up there. So we take a little bit longer of a path to get a chance at bigger loots. So here we go. So we go, want to go down here. Oh, really? It's got desync, does it? That sucks. This it used to have a lot of desync on PC as well, but they fixed it a while ago. Like, it was horrible. So this room's going to have a gauntlet in it, so it's either going to be to the left of the entrance or the left of the exit. So we'll just hug the left wall here. And then we'll, uh, we'll get through here. I hate darts. I don't have, like, movement skills to get through the darts. <laughs> I have nothing more to give. So here we go, up and to the left here. Hit the lever. Head in, and, uh, for this one you have to hit all of the levers. Hopefully you not get shot by any darts. Or actually, no, you don't have to hit all the levers, I don't think, in this one. I'm going to hit them all anyways, I can't remember. Yeah, I think hitting all the weavers will allow you to get out. So, we're going to hit them all. Get out and get into the room, too. But yeah, you had to hit all the weavers. So there we go. Grab your trove. Hopefully you get your two extra keys from those on this run. So after that, we want to head to the next area. What class am I playing? I'm playing the Scion as an Ascendant. So the next area is going to have a uh, uh, silver door and a dark shrine. And I'm playing a totem build. I'm Scion as a Hierophant and a uh, Elementalist. So we're going to head to the left first because usually one of them's to the left and one of them's to the right. We're just going to head through. And here's the Dark Shrine to the left. I'm not 100% sure of the... No, okay. The uh, Dark Shrine will be left there on this one, but sometimes the golden or the Silver Door will be there as well. Um, it's all in your playstyle, really. I've never tried Glacial Cascade Mines. I'm sure they'd be fine. But the thing with uh, Glacial Cascade is, is the more AoE you have, the less single target damage you have. Just because of the way it works. I can explain it in a minute. So down into the right should have the Silver Door. Grab the uh, Vault. And then we'll head up here. And up into the left should be the door. Aspirant's trial. An aspirant can afford to be promising. An emperor must keep the empire awaits you with. Once I kill his arrow, I'll explain it a little more, uh, turtle. 
or give my opinion on it anyway. So here we go, let's kill him. Nice and easy. And as always, at the end of the video, I will show you the loot. So we got uh, six keys. Let's see what we got. And we just made some money. That's uh, 12 exalts right there. Why is it every time I do the YouTube video for lab, I get like huge items? That's cool. So we made some money there and then six uh, keys. That's a lot of gems. Uh, any, I don't really care what's good in here. We made like money for days off this one. Uh, let's see. I'll just quickly look through this in case you guys are interested in what I think we'll sell. Blade Fury, maybe. Uh, there's not really anything good in there, but yeah. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like and subscribe button. It'll help the channel out a lot. I also stream on Twitch at www.twitchtv slash Thanks for watching and have a good one. Ooh, Harold Device is good though.